is the last part of your skirt remember I did the widest stitch and I pulled to make the garters okay so now what I did because it's one piece of thread it's giving me the tension I pulled the waist as wide as I want it to go so that the elastic would stretch wider than my actual waist and then we'll pull in so you're not gonna put your garters your actual waist because then when you pull it on it's gonna be too tight right so then I just tie the end in a knot here I do my e uh, when I'm finished with this. I do my even. I got it evenly now, as even as I could get it. Cause you want that. You want a real puff for your tulip. You don't want a, a flat tulip. And this is not stretch fabric. Eh? Actually, this is polyester cotton. Right? It's really it's a mixture of cut as a cotton blend. Okay. So it's gonna be really really nice and it's a solid color so you can wear it with almost anything right and then I'm just gonna take this my waistband I'm gonna put it on your right side so I'm starting here this is my waistband put my fabric below and I always I always know where my fabric is but you could do it on the underside too and then I stitch and I made to my waist and that's it you could say so I'll show you and now I'm gonna show you the pick of how it comes out and I hope you try it I mean if you know another way to do it you could do it too but this is just a basic way to do a tulip skirt if you want you could do half and draw it on a brown paper and make a pattern so you don't always have to be averaging anymore and do it in a variety of colors this is joanna saying don't forget